Hello my crafty friends. Welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to share with you the cards that I made for the 10 on the 10th collaboration hosted by Metal Scrap and Chick here on YouTube. Every month we make 10 Christmas cards and show them so that by the end of the year we will have our cards made and ready to send out. So anyway, let me show you what I did this month. This picture right here is a painting that one of my art teachers did several years ago now, and it was on canvas board. So I took it to one of the local shops, uh, the printer shops, and had this done. I made about 50 of them. <laughs> So I have quite a few left, so I thought I would use them up. So anyway, um, I used the blue. I went ahead and bought some heavy blue 12 by 12 cardstock because I knew that's the color I wanted to use for my card bases for this picture. And this is silver twine that I had left over from my, making my wedding invitations. And then this is heat embossing. This is the Recollection Silver. It doesn't say high detail, but it I thought it turned out pretty good. The, I think the last time I heat embossed was last Thanksgiving. It was like crazy. It's so pretty. But anyway, inside... This is a Knight of Navy, and I used, this is my probably my favorite snowflake stamp from Spellbinders. It's a 3D, and I used Marina Mist. I stamped off. And so there's that. Now, they're all slightly different. I did a few of, you'll see. Okay, so there's that one, and then here's another one. I backed this with white, and I embossed. I embossed with the, the snowflake embossing po folder by Derice. So this is white, silver. So I did this in silver, and then the same thing in the inside. white okay now this one was just the only one I had of this I went ahead and used this is Tim Holtz uh, tinsel so I did that and I also used silver on the Merry Christmas sentiment and same thing on the inside then I only have one of these I went ahead and used washi tape Silver Holly, and then Silver Merry Christmas, same on the inside. Now, this is what is interesting. I don't know if you can see it, but I accidentally embossed one of the pictures. It was turned over on my desk, and because I had these printed on white cardstock, it was it's white. And so I'm just going along. I did not turn it over. I just put it in the embossing folder and embossed it just like everything else. And I noticed it was smaller than the other ones. But then I looked at it and I went, hmm, that's actually kind of pretty. I don't know if you can see it. Yeah, there we go. So that's what I did. I backed it with, this is this silver glitter paper that I showed you the other day that I got from Amazon. Unfortunately, there's only one piece in each pack, so and I use two. So if you notice, because I used the silver here, I used the Hero Arts white detail embossing powder. And then, of course, the same on the inside. Again. So I had a few more to make. And I, when I saw that I had accidentally embossed 
I went with it and finished embossing these. So there's a whole lot of snowflakes going on. So I love snowflakes. And again, the white. Because there was a lot going on, I did not put any thing down here, any ribbon or washi tape or anything. So we've got the white Merry Christmas. Okay, last but not least. Okay, those are my 10 Christmas cards for this month. Which one was your favorite? The plain or the embossed? Let me know down in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wonderful day.